har me hearties, it's that time again. Shira me timbers, splice the main cell, grab your paintbrush. It's time for that lazy pirate again. Har har. Then time for a new video. Um, with the club up, back and running again at the moment, and um, the interest in the, after the latest Kickstarter of Burrows and Badgers, um, looks like we'll be starting a mini campaign. So I thought I'd get involved. Um, I painted up quite a few Burrows and Badgers stuff. Um, the last Kickstarter, which I backed, um, but I didn't play many games. I only managed to play one game with my uh, necromantic dark magic uh, warband. But I did paint up these uh, clansmen Highlanders, so these are going to be my warband for the new game. I probably won't use all of them in each game, but. This is the basis of the clan. So uh, we'll start off with the leader. And that is my West Highland Terrier, Hamish McEvans. Uh, basically, I researched the uh, the tartan and came up with this tartan colour. Uh, it is the Evans uh, tartan, which is my surname. <laughs> West Highland area. And to either side of him, he has Henrietta McEvans. Who is a hedgehog huntress. That's uh, a large bit of tartan I did because I gave her a tartan dress. So she's not actually supposed to be one of the Highland models from the set. But I decided to make her Highlander. Behind her, We have Angus McEvans, who is a hedgehog clan warrior. That's a lovely shield boss. So that's me hedgehogs. I'll move Hamish out of the way for a sec so we can have a look at the chaps behind him. So we have Fraser McEvans, our squirrel clansman. So it's heading up with the red squirrel. Next one we have another clan warrior, which is Duncan Mutt Evans, who is a ferret. You see, these are all one piece metal models. Absolutely gorgeous. Two small warriors. We have Brody McEvans, the Sparrow Warrior. Again, he's got the lovely boss shield. And then finally. We have Gordon McEvans, the mouse clan Highlander. His little berry again, also with the bossed. So that is the setup I have at the moment. It is seven. I was also lucky enough to be given one of the newer models. The cat Piper. So at some point she will be an added to the clan. And I think after that I only have one more clansman, I think, in the set, which is uh, the wild cat, which I need to get my hands on at some point. And then I'll have all the 
Tart and Clan Warriors from the Birds and Badgers. A little bit of flash, but nothing too bad. Seeing the amount of models. I said one piece again. Should be a real joy to paint. Anyway, our first game of this is lined up for in a couple of weeks' time, so watch this space for a bit of Birds and Badgers. Cheers for now.